can learn a lot from just in a short period of time interacting with with other stakeholders it's very it's very eye-opening as we go forward um, the level of collaboration that's required is, is really quite high uh, higher than it's ever been in our industry so that's that's the big takeaway for me that's going to be the huge challenge for us no, this is this is quite new to us. It's quite interesting, and it's uh, it's it's an interesting way to look. Uh, I think a few years into the future, at uh, at what might happen, and doing it with a group of people that, that all bring different perspectives besides a utility perspective has been really, really insightful. It is actually 20 years of energy transition uh, that you experience in half a day. We wanted to create a, a deeper understanding of the impact of energy transition on your job. Uh, working within an energy company as a professional, um, all our jobs are going to change fundamentally. But often systematic changes are hidden in numbers and hidden in graphs and it doesn't really get to you. Uh, so there is a big difference between the people who do day-to-day -day work and the people who look at strategies and to close that gap Serious gaming is a very good instrument. The uh, energy system is being represented in the game. They have sort of major stakeholder groups like the utility who delivers the energy, the government who may make public policy decisions, the customers and uh, suppliers of different types of energy. So we each take a role um, among those stakeholder groups and then within that context are given a scenario and we have to um, maintain the system in a way that meets those public policy requirements, plain and simple. I actually come from the utility space as well as coming from a telco, so I understand those worlds. And even as, in this game, I get very frustrated with the utility at their behavior, um, even though it's completely justifiable. It's completely appropriate based on the parameters that they're dealing with. Any organization that is in the energy space should, should consider doing it. Utilities need to plan for a time when the traditional ways that electricity is delivered is no longer the cheapest or the best. One of the key things in utility transformation is for utility executives to take very seriously the likelihood of coming change in the sector. I think the game forces a utility executive to really examine what the role of a utility is in the future and just gives them the ability to carry a different point of view. And that's very valuable.